Welcome to a video series on learning version control with Git. Today you'll see how you can use tags in Git. Tags allow you to mark important points in your project's history, for example a release. A plain Git tag shows you an alphabetical list of your tags. Now let's mark our current commit by tagging it as version 1. Simply type git tag and the name of the new tag. Anytime later, we can run git show if we want to know which commit we attached that tag to. Without any further arguments, the git tag command creates a lightweight tag. This means that the tag only knows which commit it's attached to, nothing more. If you add the a parameter in contrast, you'll create a so-called annotated tag. This has a couple of advantages. First, you can add a message with the m parameter. Let's look at this tag with git show. You'll notice that an annotated tag also saves when it was created and by whom. That's why I'd always recommend adding the a parameter when creating tags. In case you want to add a tag to an earlier commit, and not just a current one, you can simply add a hash to the end of the command. And in case you want to delete a tag, simply use the D parameter. That's it for now. Thanks for watching and see you soon in our next video.